guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy December and happy officially Christmas season. I have a Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes Disney unboxing for you today. This is the ultimate magic box. And I know for a fact that there are Christmas and holiday things in this box. Why do I know this? Well, because this is the second time that I have sat down to film this video. I actually filmed this over the holiday weekend, had a huge technical difficulty, lost my footage, lost all of the work I had done on Vlogmas, like just kind of messed everything up. And so I'm sitting down here on December 3rd and starting from scratch without Vlogmas and just with my uh, my plain old bibbidi bobbidi box. So please bear with me. I have opened this once before on a video, so I know what's in here. I'm not going to feign surprise, but I can tell you this box is flippin' awesome. And so I'm still very excited and I hope you are too. Oh my gosh, I had to get that off of my chest. I will leave a link to Bibbidi Bobbidi Box's website and Instagram down below. I also have a coupon code, which is Disney Kitty, if you want to save $7 off of your first Bibbidi Bobbidi Box. And without further ado, I'm going to open this bad boy for the second time, for the second time. It's just the gift that keeps on giving, really, okay? So um, this is my actually November Ultimate Magic Box. I got it uh, just after Thanksgiving. And I love everything that's in here, I'm already gonna tell you, um, but I'm mostly excited because I know there's Christmas stuff and there's like nothing better than Disney Christmas stuff, pretty much period. I got my Disney Christmas background happening, I got some Disney Christmas ears happening. My t-shirt is not Christmas, but it is from the Disney store in London. Okay, deep breaths, Becca, and uh, here we go. So I'm going to open it up, and I love what they have done for their packing slip this month. They have a Monsters, Inc. themed, no peeking packing slip, so you've got Mike Wazowski and he's wrapped up in a little bow, and you've got Sully. I will um, take a peek at this at the end of the video, even though I already know what's in here, and I'm not gonna lie to you and pretend like I don't, because I try to be honest on this channel, <laughs> if you can't tell. And um, they also did a really amazing holiday card this year, and it's got Roz from Monsters, Inc., and it says, scary or nice. So there's like naughty and nice, but then there's also apparently scary and nice. And the card says, happy holiday season, from the team here at BBB, that stands for Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes, Amanda, Becky, and Brenda. Um, and they are just the loveliest ladies, and I love being able to be an ambassador for an incredible small business. So um, thank you, ladies, for including me in your in your Bibbidi Bobbidi unboxing team for 2019. It's been an amazing year. And it's time to get into the good stuff. Everything in this box is super awesome. I'm gonna start with the thing that was totally on my holiday shopping list for my upcoming trip to Disney. I'll be headed down there in um, less than two weeks now. And the first thing that I found in my box was my favorite pair of Disney Parks ears that were released for the holiday season. This is the uh, buffalo plaid kind of Sherpa bow um, pair of ears, and I think these are so cute. They came out with a handful of ears, and honestly, this is like the only one that I had really planned to purchase or or somehow get a hold of, and this is now checked off my, my shopping list. So I'm gonna swap out these ears, which I, which I love, by the way, I'll link to these down below. Um, these are from a small shop called So This Is Love Designs. I'm gonna put on my official kind of fluffy buffalo plaid ears. Here we go. Awesome! So these are um, an official Disney Parks item. It just makes you want to put like a big puffy coat on. I'm totally gonna bring this down to the parks with me and maybe wear them to the uh, Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. Moving on to another holiday themed Disney item that is probably going to be the most awkward part of this unboxing. I was really excited when I saw this the first time around. It is one of the Disney Wishables plush blind bag. So every month Disney comes out with this like series of cute little plushies. They come in these little blind bags and they have different themes. There's been like Haunted Mansion and Splash Mountain and Winnie the Pooh. And for November they came out with a holiday series and um, the options are Santa Mickey, a reindeer, a snowman, or a gingerbread man. And I really, really wanted to get the reindeer, but I got the snowman. I already unboxed it, you know, unbagged it on my previous video, which I lost the footage for. So I was a little sad to get the snowman, but he's still really darn cute. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Okay, bye. So I'm going to set Mr. Snowman back here underneath the 
piglet on my desk. And uh, I really did enjoy getting this in my box. I love obviously in a blind bag or a, or a blind box item. And I still want the reindeer, so when I'm down in Disney World, it's possible that I'll pick up a couple more of these bags because the reindeer and the Christmas parade are like my flippin' favorite thing at the holidays. The next thing I'll show you is this little envelope that says a present for you. And I believe that this little packet of goodies was included in everybody's November box for the holiday season, like a little extra gifty from the team at Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes. Don't quote me on that, that's not a fact. I haven't looked that up, I haven't asked them, but I'm guessing that everybody got this. And inside, there are some Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes exclusive stickers and also a magnet. And they're all super cute. I've obviously looked at them all before because this is a weird unboxing today. Um, but let me show you. They're all holiday themed and they're all super, super adorable. Do you like my nails, by the way? I had these done last week for Vlogmas. <laughs> but since I'm no longer doing Vlogmas, I'm just gonna show them off right here. Check out the nails. Okay, the first sticker is this Holiday Beauty and the Beast sticker, and you've got Beast and Belle, and they are taking out all of the stored holiday decorations. I actually did this myself over the weekend, and you've got Chip and Cogsworth and Lumiere all helping out. And I love that Belle is in her green dress. You almost never see her in her green dress. Next, we have some more favorite Disney characters decorating their own tree. This is kind of an under the sea tree made of pink coral. We've got Ariel from The Little Mermaid, as well as Sebastian and Flounder. And I love that she is putting a starfish at the top of her coral and like sea green tree. The next sticker is this one. You've got Mickey and Minnie. They are having some hot cocoa and they are sitting on top of some presents. Maybe they're kind of trying to hide the presents from each other. Super cute. Then we have this one, which I love. It says, don't you just love Christmas? And you've got Mickey and behind him is Donald and Donald's winking and I think he's holding a snowball. So you can tell that Donald Duck is like totally up to some winter mischief. And I love all of the little snowflakes and the little holly berries on this one. This is just a gorgeous design. And then finally in this little packet we have a magnet and it's Mickey and Minnie inside of a wreath and I'm gonna actually stick this on my filing cabinet behind me right now for the holidays. I don't know if you can see this, but it's uh, it's back there next to my um, Mickey Mouse pass holder magnet. So yay, I love that little touch. I love stickers obviously and Bibbidi Bobby Boxes comes up with some great ones. So thank you, thank you BBB for that. There are two more items in this box and I'm kind of doing this in order of like saving the best things for last. So I'm gonna show you like my second favorite thing and then my last favorite thing last, if that makes sense, because I already know what's in here. Ah, so um, here is my like second to last, my second most favorite thing in the box. It is an exclusive Disney Parks pin. It's actually a limited edition pin. And if you have been following the uh, holiday pin releases, um, every year they come out with a different holiday pin for each of the different resorts in Walt Disney World and usually also in Disneyland. And this is the official pin for the Contemporary Resort, which is an awesome resort, kind of classic, original. Disney World Resort. And the pin design this year is gorgeous. It's all these little holiday bells and they've got little glitters on them. It says Happy Holidays 2019. And then this in the center here says Disney's Contemporary Resort, but it's also a spinner and look, they all have a different character and the contemporary one has Tinkerbell and she is one of my all time favorite Disney characters, especially for 2019. She's been kind of my girl this year, my mascot this year, and she is sprinkling some pixie dust. There's fireworks in the background. It's just such an amazing pin. Um, these are limited edition. They got two pin posts on the back. This one is limited edition of 2000. You can see it up here. You got the official pin trading stamp. And I do really enjoy um, the backer cards this year too. It's just really pretty and festive. I love the tree. So I love this item. Um, this is a pin that I, I would have bought it in the parks if I saw it there in person. I'm not sure if many of these have sold out yet or, or how much longer they're gonna be available, but this is definitely one of my favorite of the resort pins this year. And I'm so thrilled that it was in my box. Okay, and if that wasn't enough, I can confidently say that I have saved the best item for last this month. I went and saved 
save the best for last. And this is an item that I actually put on my Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes wish list. They have a little feature that every month you can log into Club Bibbidi Bobbidi Box and you can kind of choose from their current inventory like what is high priority on your own wish list. And um, this is one of the items that really caught my eye. It's a lounge fly bag and I have a lot of lounge fly bags but I don't have anything like this. Ah, here it is. Um, this is one of my favorite lounge fly bags I've ever seen. It's obviously 101 Dalmatians themed. It's not Christmas, but because of the red, it looks very festive. Like I, I might totally wear this around the parks during the holiday season because it looks festive with the red and the white. Um, but here's a close up. This is by Loungefly. And I can never remember the names of the different Dalmatians. I, like one's Lucky and one's Patch. And I can't remember which one is which, frankly. Um, but the flap opens up. And there's another Dalmatian inside. It's actually kind of like a magnetized little, little guy there. And then inside, look at the adorable lining. It's got all these little puppy spots. There's um, there's a an extra pouch inside. Actually, two, uh, two extra pouches inside to keep your, you know, your valuables or your things that you don't want to get like all messed up inside your bag. And I think it's just like such a gorgeous crossbody. And I have quite a few lounge fly backpacks now at this point, but I don't always want to carry a backpack. Sometimes it's just cuter or it works better with an outfit um, to wear a crossbody. And I'm really, really excited to have this. I think it's a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous item. And it even smells really good. So oh, I'm really excited. It actually matches my outfit that I, I have on today. Definitely one of my favorite lounge fly Disney collabs that I have seen. So. I, this is my favorite item. Like every item in this box was awesome, but this is, this is one of my favorites of like the, my past several boxes, frankly. It's just so, it's so, so cute. I need to rewatch 101 Dalmatians. I, I love Disney cats and dogs, but I haven't watched this movie in so long and I need to remember, I need to like refresh myself. So that is on my to-do list before I head down to the parks or at least before the uh, calendar turns to 2020 is rewatch. 101 Dalmatians, and I will be doing that on Disney Plus, which I am loving, by the way. Okay, so that was everything. Should we take a quick look at this uh, packing slip? We'll just go over the retail price on everything. Oh, there's one thing that I forgot to put back in my box. Oh, shoot. If this is what happens when you film an unboxing twice. There's one thing I took out. Let me see if I can find it. I'm the worst, oh my gosh. This is real life people like you might think YouTube is all like tailored and pristine but like it's just really real here there's one more thing in my box that I forgot to put back in hold on hold on oh my gosh okay here it is I had set it back there on my desk and I forgot to put it back in but it's adorable and I also love this so here is the final item that was in the box um it's by park bound buttons i love park bound i i used to order from park bound uh back when i first got into the whole disney small shop thing and it says berry christmas and it features winnie the pooh holding a candy cane you've got some poinsettia leaves or some holly berries and it's got a nice pun berry christmas i love a pun i don't like to wear puns but i will definitely put this um on my holiday pin board which I'm hoping to to do before Christmas for for you all. So this was a great item as well. Okay, now I can do the packing slip. So first of all, we have the wonderful Christmas Poo Berry Christmas Park Bound Button. This is four dollars, four dollar retail price. So cute. My Buffalo Plaid Pom Pom Ears. The Disney Parks ears are thirty dollars now in the parks. The ears used to be twenty eight, and they just went up to thirty dollars, which. Seems crazy, but that's that's Disney pricing for you. It's one of the reasons why I have big plans to um, to curb my Disney spending going forward. Um, my awesome, awesome, gorgeous lounge fly bag featuring 101 Dalmatians was $68. I feel like the lounge fly prices have kind of bumped up a lot lately too, just, just in time for the holidays. Uh, and then we have the um, Disney Parks exclusive trading pin, the holiday Tinkerbell pin. My pin, it's an $18 item. These go for $17.99 in the park, so $18. That's 
normal. And then finally we had my little snowman wishable and those are $10. So the total retail value of my box is $130. The box costs $119. Um, so you get a little bit over the retail value plus everything is exquisitely curated. They've got a great wish list feature, their club bibbity bobbity boxes, which you can update on a monthly basis. And it kind of gives you a preview of some of their inventory. Um, if you've been watching my channel for any amount of time, you know I love bibbity bobbity boxes and I'm always singing their praises and they're just such lovely human beings as well. And also if you wanted to save $7, you can always use my code Disney Kitty. So that makes it an even better value. Okay, I'm gonna wrap up this video right here before anything else goes wrong. Leave a comment down below. Let me know which item was your favorite. Also, if you think of it, I'm really curious what you are watching on Disney Plus. If you have Disney Plus, like what has been your favorite discovery on Disney Plus? So my favorite thing that I have discovered is the Encore series. It's hosted by Kristen Bell and they get together all of these like adult people and they have a restaging of a musical that they did in high school and it's amazing. It's so funny. If you love musical theater, please watch Encore on Disney Plus. Let me know if you've watched it or let me know what your favorite Disney Plus recommendation is. Besides Baby Yoda, because I we all love Baby Yoda. And that's all I have for today. Again, all of the information that you need to know about Bibbidi Bobbidi Boxes is down in my description box. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your patience. I apologize that Vlogmas is not happening, but um, it was just not meant to be. My life is really crazy right now. I've got some travel coming up and I think the universe was just like, Becca, not happening this year. But I will be back soon with more Disney and holiday related content for you. Until then, I hope you're having a magical day and a beautiful holiday season, and I will see you real soon. Bye guys! Mwah.